Good morning. This is Patrick McCullough, forecaster here at the National Weather Service office in San Angelo. Look at the upcoming forecast across West Central Texas. This briefing is being updated early Sunday morning. Well, we uh, had a uh, round of uh, freezing rain overnight, uh, stretching from uh, uh, about the uh, Abilene area southwest towards Starling City in San Angelo and Ozona. Heaviest rain seems to uh, freezing rain seems to have fallen from uh, about San Angelo up toward. Uh, Ballinger and headed east toward uh, Bronwyn and Coleman uh, early this morning. It kind of left um, uh, vehicles and signs um, covered in ice, probably some uh, stairways as well, and probably some uh, at least some patchy ice on uh, roadway, so especially on, on bridges and overpasses. So if you are going to be heading out early this morning, slow down and allow for uh, some extra time to reach your destination. Conditions should start to improve uh, after sunrise. Uh, as the freezing rain moves east of the area and temperatures begin to, uh, to to warm just a little bit, although I think in some areas the uh, freezing rain may stay on the ground through uh, mid to late morning. Otherwise, um, I think uh, we'll see uh, warmer temperatures uh, by by late afternoon as the clouds begin to uh, break up a little bit. High temperatures climbing into the upper 30s and lower 40s. After a cold night tonight, looking for a uh, warming trend through the uh, rest of the week. In fact, I think we'll be looking at high temperatures on Monday in the in the 50s, in the 60s on Tuesday, and by Wednesday and Thursday, we're going to be looking at temperatures climbing into the 70s, or perhaps even pushing toward the 80 degree mark uh, for for much of West Central Texas. That's ahead of a cold front pushing through the area late Thursday night into Friday. That cold front will bring a chance of a rainfall for Friday, Saturday, and even into Sunday across much of the area, and that's a much cooler conditions with high temperatures back into the uh, 50s for most locations. Now, we know everybody wants to know how much rain is going to be falling uh, over the, over uh, next weekend. A little, yeah, a little hard to tell at this point, a little early, uh, but uh, keep an eye on the forecast, and we'll be updating you with, uh, with what we think is going to be going on uh, as we get to later into the week. Thank you, and, and we'll continue to keep you updated.